Hello YouTube and welcome back to Garrett's Games, the show where I play video games and my name is Garrett. We're playing This War of Mine and my little intrepid band of survivors in the middle of a civil war is getting pretty good at trading for the goods that we can't produce ourselves. However, that can only last for so long and at some point you have to go out and start scavenging for stuff again. And that starts to happen in this video. Let's see how it goes. Day 20. I wish I could bring so much stuff every night. Oh dear. Pavel was overcome with grief and couldn't sleep, so Bruno was trying to console him. I don't even know how to deal with that, necessarily. Oh, Marin's very hungry. And so is Bruno. Can you go cook, Bruno? Stop being a whiny crybaby. <coughs> I need more food out of that trap. Need more parts in order to make it another freaking trap. Cook for me, brother. So you can make two different types of food, and basically if you make cooked food, um, it requires a meat and a vegetable and slightly more water. Basically, basically you make two foods instead and it requires slightly less than double resources, so you should always, always make cooked food if you can, because it will wind you up with two, you know, things. You tired, Pavel? You're my scavenger, buddy, so I need you... Mm. Bruno's very hungry. Why don't you sit down and have a cigarette? I got you some. Didn't I? Yes, I did. Oh, shit. Sorry, Bruno. I need you to cook first, dude. Didn't mean to give you a sense of false hope. What do you need, kids? Didn't I already help you once? We're hungry. <sighs> Two canned foods. Ugh. If I could help the kids, I'd probably give a big morale boost to everybody in the house, but... Gotta get more parts. And I'm not doing too great on wood either. You know, I might start this game over now because I've learned so many things about it since I started playing, but I kind of, I, I really don't like abandoning games right in the middle, you know? 
Uh, I feel like we should put wood in this fire. A thermoregulator, man. Bruno, you should go to bed, dude. I put the freaking heating on. Heater's on. What are y'all complaining about? Anywhere I can go that has materials is where I need to go tonight because I need more parts because I need more food. Pavel's still sick and sad. I think I need to send Katya scavenging tonight, which is not good. No, you should sleep. Keep sleeping, bro. <clears throat> no materials. Weapons. No materials. No materials. No materials. No materials. No materials. No materials. Great. Fantastic. Construction site has huge amounts of food. I'm just so worried about Katya getting shot. If she gets shot, everybody if she gets shot, everybody's gonna kill themselves. Lots of weapons at the supermarket. <clears throat> Screw it, let's go for food and meds. Got no weapons to bring with me, so off we go. Don't hear anything. Don't see anything. Not feeling confident. Oh, this is a big old place. What the hell? Grab all. Can we see or hear anything? Nothing except tons of gunshots, which don't make me feel good at all. I would feel the lower levels are going to be okay to search, but beyond that, it's going to get increasingly dangerous.
I see you tempting me, little hand. Okay, nobody here yet. We can get across. Isn't that a platform? Oh, not yet. Okay, fine. So many gunshots. They don't make me feel good. I'm scared. So you can't get across except like all the way at the top. Oh, oh, bad people. Oh, bad people. Can I make it up there without them seeing me? We're going to give it a shot. Oh no, where are you going? Oh god, I'm scared. I don't hear them anymore. I feel like I should hear them, but I don't at all. I think I should hear something, anything. Why am I so scared? This game is so good at making you feel terrified. Okay, so it's now they're shooting on the other side. Whoa. Ah, ah. Quiet, Katya. Don't let anything happen to yourself. <sighs> Ooh, lots of stuff here. Please be valuable. Oh, oh, run, Katya. Run. Run, Katya. Run. You can make it. Don't die. Don't die. Don't die. Don't die. Oh, oh, don't die. Oh, just don't die. Run to the exit. <sighs> and I got nothing tonight. I got practically fucking nothing. Whatever, it was almost dawn anyway. Whew. 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 Okay, that was terrifying. That was terrifying. I thought I lost everything. Pavel still overcome with grief. Fantastic. Bruno, go to sleep. Marin, go to sleep. It's going to get a lot colder. Great. 
Ah, classical music. Suffered heavy losses, military retreated, resumed the strategy of avoiding confrontation. Oh, moving around the city should once again be possible. That's really, really good to hear. Pavel, go eat. Still need more parts. But tonight is should be a good night for scavenging. More parts and everything else. Let's make some more veggies, man. Make them. Make them up. I'm going to make some herbs because I really need to make a medicine because Pavel is still sick. I know it's not a good day, you guys. Stick with it. We're going to be fine. Eat some veggies, Katya. Sorry, I don't have anything better to offer you. Ugh. Ugh. I'm so sorry. I wish we could help you. Bruno's giving, or uh, Marin's giving up. Please don't give up. Katya's going to go up there and kind of buck him up a little bit. Oh, boy. So they have to talk now, and they can't work while they're talking. I can't do anything today. I should probably just end the day. At least Katya talked him down off the ledge. I just hope she doesn't get depressed. Yeah, I'm going to end the day, because one, it's depressing, two, it's boring for the stream, and three, I don't have anything that I can actually do. So Katya should sleep. Uh, you're going to scavenge. You're going to sleep. You're going to guard, Bruno. Materials, give me materials. Please, somebody have some fucking materials. Nothing. Nobody has any. Nothing.
All right, I'm going to go. I'm going to send. I'm going to send Pavel to the construction site and see if he can do any better about getting some more food for everybody. <sighs> Don't die, Pavel. If you die, I'm, we're we're giving up. We're we're starting the game over. If I had a shovel, I would feel a lot better about this. I know, I know, if only you had some kind of shovel. If I see a red blip, I'm out of here. Or I'm going to stop digging at least. Whew. I think my stream got disconnected. Oh, how annoying. Hope it's still recording at least. Okay, so at this point, the video uh, recording completely crapped out, and I'm very sorry uh, about that. I know that was, like, one of the worst places that could have happened. Uh, suffice it to say, Pavel got some really good stuff from the uh, building, but uh, made it out safely uh, and with no incident. So that's sort of the summary version of what happened, and I really wish that I could have shown it to you. I'm, I, I'm, I'm sorry, video recording equipment just, just sometimes doesn't work. Eh. Thanks very much for watching. Tune in as I continue to try to keep these people alive in the depths of winter. I will see you next time. Bye.